Hey, so this is going to be a different kind of video. On every video, I get asked by someone in the comments, what are you wearing on your lips? And today I'm actually going to document it. I'm just wearing a lip gloss and I'm not usually a lip gloss kind of gal. It's the Fenty Beauty Universal, whatever it's called. This is the Universal Gloss Balm in the shade Fenty Glow. It's all right, it smells nice, tastes nice. I don't know if it's converted me to lip gloss just yet, but we'll see. I posted to Twitter there a few days ago saying, okay, I've had a par paranormal experience, don't know what to make of it, don't know what to do, blah, blah, blah. And people are like, okay, you have to tell us. And people are messaging me now like, Laura, when are you gonna tell us? So people are really into paranormal stuff and I totally get that because I'm into it as well. But because it happened to me, I'm really like, I don't know if I should tell anyone. And I don't know if it's paranormal or if it's extraterrestrial or if it's something spiritual. I don't know, I don't know. But sure, maybe, maybe you can shed some light for me in the comment section down below. Equally, if you've had an experience similar or like this, can you let me know too so I don't feel like such a freak? Oh, and another remark a few people made was, yeah, but Laura, you have this paranormal, paranormal stuff happens to you all the time. No. People tend to see weird paranormal things around me. <laughs> um, I might do a video on that if you want, but this is going to be based on my one experience. But yeah, people have seen weird things around me as I sleep, you know, things rock. Yeah, well, I'll get into it in another video. Anyway, three, four days ago, lying in bed, about to go to sleep. And before I go to sleep, I usually pop in some earphones, lie back and listen to some relaxing music just to chill me out and get me set up for really nice dreams. <laughs> so I'm lying there and I'm trying to sleep face up to avoid getting wrinkles on my face. Um, so I go to sleep facing up, so sleeping kind of like Dracula. I wake up in the morning the exact opposite, but that's, that's irrelevant. So I'm lying there and I have my hands just down by my sides and I'm just kind of listening to the chill music and then all of a sudden I feel I can feel the sensation that someone is holding my left hand. So I didn't feel anyone reaching in. It was like one second my hand was normal and the next second someone is holding it. And obviously inwardly I'm like, okay, this is weird. I don't know what to do. Um, inwardly I'm freaking out a, bit, a little bit, but I don't feel frightened. I, at no stage did I feel frightened. I didn't feel like it was a threat. That could have been my gut, I, I don't know, I don't know. So eventually my mind calmed down and I was like, okay, maybe this isn't necessarily a bad thing. And then I could feel whatever was holding my hand pulling me to the left. And to the left of where I lie in my bed is there is there's the window. And I knew subconsciously whatever this was wanted me to go to the window. And it was just kind of, it wasn't moving my hand, but I could feel it. I could feel it trying to move my hand over to the left, almost like it was guiding me over towards this window. Needless to say, I did not go to the window. I don't want to look out my window and see some sort of like ET shit ready to beam me up into its spaceship. No. So I know some of you would be like, Laura, you were asleep. I definitely wasn't asleep because I, I physically remember this. And I remember thinking, oh my God, is this a dream? But then I really realized if I realize it's a dream, I'm probably not asleep. And I knew I was fully, fully conscious at this point. And eventually whatever it was that was trying to pull me to the window, pull my hand, lead me, guide me to the window, it stopped and bang, it was gone and the sensation was gone. That was the end of it, that, that was it, that's the extent of it and you're probably like, that's all that happened? Yeah, look, that's all that happened. And I remember kind of opening my eyes and looking around me and just thinking, that was weird, but it wasn't scary. I don't know, I feel like whatever it was, wasn't here to hurt me. And then I mentioned it to two people in my real life the next day and they were both like, Jesus, Laura. <laughs> There's been nothing else since. What do you think? I really want to hear what your thoughts are in the comment section down below. I'm not going crazy. I did not imagine it and it wasn't a dream. I definitely felt something holding my left hand and trying to get me to go over to the window. I wasn't scared of it and I, I, I like, I feel like, I feel like I have pretty good gut intuition and I don't think this was here to hurt me. So there you go. That was my paranormal story, my spiritual story, whatever the hell it was. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.